What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well today. As you guys can tell by today's video title, we are back again with another testing five most viral products from TikTok. I've been doing these videos quite a lot recently and you guys really seem to enjoy them. So I thought I would do another one. We have a bunch of new products to try out in this one. As always, I like to give you guys variety. So we've got some kitchen gadgets, we've got some toys, we've got some beauty products. So we have a bit of everything. In case you guys haven't seen my previous video from this little series, I'll have them all linked in the eye and the description so make sure you guys check them out after this video but without further ado let's get into the video all right so the very first viral tiktok product that we're going to be putting to the test today is from this tiktok right here this tiktok is currently sitting at 8.7 million views which is honestly just so crazy it's basically showing this product for your hair called the color wow dream coat now this is what kim kardashian's hairstylist uses on her and honestly kim's hair always looks insane. Whenever I see like high quality photo shoots of her, her hair always looks so slick and no frizz in sight. So it could totally be down to this product this whole time, which I am so excited about trying. I got mine on Amazon and I think it was like 20 pounds, maybe just a little bit less. I don't have particularly frizzy hair. My hair is naturally quite straight, but as you guys can see, I do have some like flyaways at the top. I've got some flyaways at the back. I think that's just from years and years of bleaching my hair. I feel like my hair has not yet recovered. I mean, can I just say her hair after using this product looks absolutely amazing. It looks so smooth, so slick and I just want that for my hair. What this product claims to do is magically transform your hair texture and apparently it's also got humidity proofing powers so I am so excited. So with this product you actually have to wash your hair first and apply it to your damp hair and then dry it afterwards. So I'm gonna go wash my hair now and we're gonna apply this bad boy together. All right guys so I've just washed my hair it is now ready for the color wow to be sprayed all throughout. Oh all right so I'm just gonna go from the top and I'm just gonna like give it enough, you know? I have got long hair. I'm also gonna do the underneath. I'm now just gonna dry my whole hair with my Dyson. Alright, here we are. Here is my hair nice and dry. I have to say, it does look very slick on camera, just from all the way back here. But to be honest, while I looked in the mirror, it is quite frizzy still. I always have this problem whenever my hair is freshly washed, it goes really, really frizzy, but then it kind of settles down afterwards. So it could just be that, but I mean... It doesn't look as slick as it looked in the video. Also, it feels a little bit sticky. Like when I brush my fingers through it, it's almost like the hair is sticking together, which I don't know if that's what's supposed to happen. Perhaps that's what makes it like waterproof in a way. I have a little water dropper here. So we're gonna do the water drop test and see if it absorbs into my hair. Okay, three, two, one. Ooh. It ran off my hair. I think usually when you do that on regular hair, the water gets absorbed into your hair pretty much straight away, but that literally ran off my hair like water droplets. I feel like my hair may not be frizz free from this product. However, I do have to say it is definitely waterproof. Also, I don't know if that's the product or what, but my hair feels a lot thicker now. I don't know why. Maybe it's just the volume that it gives. All in all, I do like the product. I feel like my hair looks and feels nice. And I think I just have to get the hang of how to make Make it look frizz free. Okay, moving on to the next viral TikTok product. We're gonna be trying out a kitchen gadget this time. If you've been on my channel for a little while, you'll know that I am not the best cook. So any kind of gadget that can make my life in the kitchen easier, I am down for. What this product is, is a vegetable chopper. This has 3 million views and that's just one of the TikToks. I've seen plenty other ones that have way more. In the comments of this TikTok, there's a lot of people that are saying this isn't anything new. My mom or grandma has had this for years. Is, but to be honest, for me, this is a new gadget. I've never seen anything like this before. So I picked mine up from Amazon once again. Good old trusty Amazon Prime. This particular one cost me £22, which I feel like isn't too bad. So let's unbox it and see what this is all about. Oh my goodness. That just completely broke apart. What the hell? Oh my lord. It was just so loose in the box. And when I pulled this thing out, it just like pulled everything out. Luckily, it seems to all be in one piece, but I guess we'll find out later if that's the case. From what I can see, there's a lot of components to this. So we have 
all these different attachments that you can replace. We also have these blades, which I have no idea what they do. It also comes with a little vegetable peeler as well as this thing, which again, I don't know what this is for. Maybe for like a jacket potato. So this is kind of how it all slots together. You put whatever attachment you want in here and then you press down on whatever you're trying to cut and it should pretty much have a perfect diced version of it in this compartment. I have to say, it's quite a large item to just keep in your cupboard at all times in your kitchen, especially if you're like me and you hoard all the pots, all the pans. But if this actually works, I guess I could make a little bit of room in my kitchen for it. So let's go try it out. All right guys, welcome to my kitchen. We are gonna be trying out this little vegetable chopper with two different vegetables because I actually wanna try it out in two different ways. First up, we're gonna try this slicer in here. now. I'm using the biggest like setting I guess so we're gonna put the potato in there oh god it's quite a big potato <laughs> I might have to cut it in half hang on okay I've cut my potato in half okay are we ready three two one oh it's not doing anything oh no have I not got enough like strength to push this down oh no I really thought this was going to be easy. I felt like I'm having a wrestling fight with this potato. It has gone through, but just not quite all the way. Look at that. What is going on here? Okay, Matt is going to have a go. I feel like he's strong. Ooh, that looked really easy. How did you make that look so easy? I just, just pushed on it. Do you want to try it, try <laughs> what it again? What do you mean? You just push. What do you mean you just pushed? Ugh. Oh, wow. Okay, I definitely lack the arm strength for this tool. Well, though, look at that. If you have the strength, this is going to save you so much time because that would have taken forever to cut by hand. Okay, that definitely works. Just not for me. <laughs> I feel like the top part is going to be a little bit easier for someone like me that doesn't have the strength. All you're supposed to do is just, like, glide it. And it's supposed to cut anything into little strips. Is it working? Okay, that definitely grated my skin. That's pretty easy though, let's have a look. Wait, where is it? What the hell, there's nothing in there. There's no carrot, where did it go? <laughs> Seriously, wait, oh, did it go in here? How do I open this? Why would it go in here though? Surely not. I'm so confused right now. Oh, here it is, secret compartment. I like this, this is perfect for like salads, I'm gonna make some sushi tomorrow, so I might like use this. This is really good. Okay, so all in all, this definitely works. Whether you have the strength for it, that's another question though. All right, now moving on to the next viral product. I feel like I'm most excited for this one, honestly, just because I am a big kid at heart. Here is the TikTok that has completely just gone viral. And I mean, for good reason, because this looks like fun. This TikTok has 1.1 million views and it is basically a toy for kids. However, it doesn't have to be. It could be like a pill dispenser, for example, if you take daily vitamins. I feel like this would be such a fun way to take them. Ever since I was a kid, I would love claw machines. And I know that when you go to like an arcade, they're mostly rigged. However, this one is not because you get to control it yourself. So here it is. I ordered this once again from Amazon and it actually came as a set of three, which I mean, the more the merrier. I can gift some of these to my friends. Of course, I'm gonna go for the pink one, right? This is so so freaking cute. Guys, look how adorable this is. I cannot. Okay, so basically you take the little cover off like this and then you have all these tiny little dinosaurs that are supplied with it, which is perfect because we're the dinosaur family on this channel. It's almost like it was meant to be. I feel like because this is so miniature, you guys cannot see a thing. So let's zoom you guys in. All right, guys. So here is the claw machine up close. I just think it's the cutest thing ever. I've also filled it with the little dinosaurs that came with it. Basically, it has three buttons. It has this one, this one, and then one in the back. The back one is in charge of the claw going up and down. This one one is the one that kind of like clenches the claw whereas this one here is the one that maneuvers the claw left and right okay let's give it an attempt I really want to see if I can grab one of these little dinosaurs which one should we go for maybe this one okay so I'm going down I'm grabbing <gasps> it grabbed it oh it just missed it let's try it again going down for that green one grabbing it going up <gasps> oh my god, will it go in? 
Yay! <laughs> oh my god, this actually works. Where does it get collected? Wait, does it just like pull out? <gasps> where they all go let's pop them back in here okay i'm going down i'm grabbing <gasps> i got two! Oh my god do you guys see that then we're moving to the right oh no i'm gonna lose one <gasps> i lost one and release seriously this is so much fun i feel like with tiny little sweets this would be such a cool gadget for kids or even adults i mean i'm an adult but i'm still enjoying this this is literally so fun i wish i had one of these when i was a kid i feel like this is one of those really useless things however if you put like sweets in it or like i said maybe your vitamins this could actually be a thing that you use daily and it gives it a good purpose so i'm gonna give this one a big thumbs up all right now moving on to the the next product we are going to be trying out a product that has 13.7 million views i want you guys to guess in the comments what you think this may be i feel like none of you will be able to guess okay are you guys ready it is a back stretcher. What this is, is a chiropractor kind of like back stretcher. If you have problems with your back, I feel like this would be a really beneficial product for you to try. Personally, I'm quite stretchy with my back. I can really arch it quite well. So I feel like I'll get on with this pretty good. As you can see in the TikTok, you can set it to different levels. So you can start off really small and then work your way up and really stretch it out. So here is the one that I picked up. It was only 13 pounds. It's not exactly the same as the one in the TikTok, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna do the same job. The the thing that I'm really confused about is why this area is bulged so much. I showed this to Matt and he goes, no, that's his butt. And I'm like, no, you're supposed to use this on your back, not on your tummy. So like, what is that? It's just such a weird shape. Like, why is it there? Like this person's crotch is down here. So what is this? I am very confused about that picture, but I guess let's put this to the test and hopefully I will not break my back. All right guys, so we're here trying out the chiropractor back stretcher or whatever this is called. I've just assembled this, which was actually quite difficult because this part here, this little board, hasn't got that much flex in it. So we had to like freaking, it was a two man job basically. So I guess we're gonna try it out now. So I'm gonna put it flat on the ground. This is where your butt goes and then this is where your top goes. So let's try it out. I'm really scared. I actually feel like this could crack my back because I haven't stretched this morning. I also did it on the most inclined setting. So we'll see how stretchy my back really is. Ooh, that is a very big incline, you guys. Am I doing it properly? Ooh, I just felt something clicking in my back. Would I say this feels comfortable? I mean, to be honest, whenever I lay down on a flat surface, it's always comfortable, so <laughs> it's not much different, but I feel like this would be really good for people that aren't very flexible. Someone like Matt, who's behind the camera right now, he would never be able to do this incline, would you? No. <laughs> It is so, so extreme, but it does feel quite nice. So having tried this on the like highest setting, I am really gutted that it didn't click my back, but I am quite a flexible person, so that's probably why my back didn't click. All right, and now the last product we're gonna be trying out is a color-changing foundation. Now I've tried color-changing blushes, lipsticks, all sorts of different products, but never foundation, I don't think. So this is a very viral and very overhyped kind of product. So I am here to test it out. This is called the L'Oreal Paris CC Say Magic. I think that's how you say it. This is a anti-redness skin enhancer. And basically what this is, is a BB or CC cream that is green, but then when it comes into contact with your skin, it's apparently supposed to match your skin tone perfectly. Now full disclaimer, I 100% know this isn't gonna work for everybody. I feel like for anyone with a darker skin tone, this is just gonna be a no-no, which is a bit of a shame that they couldn't make this a little bit more inclusive, but I guess we're gonna try it out on my skin tone and see if it even works. All right, guys, so I've zoomed you guys in a little bit closer. We're gonna be trying this out. Now, what I've seen people do is apply this foundation straight to their face, and as you guys can see, it is very green. Now, obviously, I do have makeup on already, but we're just gonna try this out on top just to really see how this color blends out and just how it changes into my skin tone. I've seen various people do various techniques of blending, but I'm just going to use my hand because that's what I've seen most people do. So let's just start 
literally blending this out. Now because this is green, it's supposed to kind of like balance out any redness in your face. Oh wow, look at that. It has completely blended out into a beige skin tone. What the hell? This is crazy, you guys. Are we seeing this? It has really good coverage too. I still had some imperfections peeking out from under my conceal that I already had on. So this has just completely covered this up. All right, let's witness the magic happen on this cheek wow it blends out so quick this is crazy you guys makeup has come such a long way like this is such a cool invention okay looking up close that is genuinely my perfect match like are we seeing this there is no harsh lines there is no orange it is just the perfect shade i'm gonna go ahead and say this is a really really good cc cream it has really good coverage it's covered up my blemishes and it blends out to be your perfect shade. I totally get what the hype is about now. This product is literally magic in a bottle. All right, guys, so that is everything for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing what viral products are trending right now on TikTok. As always, I had so much fun trying these out, and if you haven't seen my previous videos, definitely check them out. In one of my other ones, I tried out this really crazy razor that had like five heads attached to one thing. Honestly, it amazes me what kind of products go viral on TikTok these days. It is never a bland day. As always, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you smash that huge thumbs up down below and also be sure to tag me or send me any kind of like products that you want me to try in these videos in the future. I've actually got a really exciting like viral product review that one of you guys sent to me on Instagram. So that's gonna be coming up soon. Just wait and see. But anyways, that is all for this video. I hope you're all well and hopefully I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye! Mm.